Hey, what's going on, food fam? I'm back. I have my smoker right here. The type of wood that I'm gonna be using in the smoker today is called black walnut. I love it. Instead of using pecan or oak, you know, I'm gonna use this black walnut. And I tend to use black walnut more than any other type of wood. It works out phenomenal. So let's go ahead and get it tossed in. Now that we're getting a good sear on our steaks, we have it go ahead and see, it's just that simple. You can spend time with your family. You don't have to have a big, fancy, expensive cook range. You don't have to have a big, fancy smoker. You don't have to have all that. Just utilize the resources that you have. That's what I always suggest to my clients. And I always suggest to my family members and friends, utilize the resources you have because they transcend any industry you work in if you utilize the resources that are available to you. So we're gonna go ahead and flip this steak. And when we flip it, we're not gonna be looking for too much uh, time on the other side because these steaks, guess what? These steaks, they're gonna get thrown into that smoker right there. This smoker is about 32, 35 years old, somewhere around that range. And it was built by a family member. God rest his soul. Cousin Willie Lawrence Ingram. He was a phenomenal man. Father, husband, hard worker. I love them. Still do. God bless them. I have to give a shout out to Cousin Willie Lawrence Ingram for making that. God rest his soul. So we're going to go ahead and pull this one off. And let's go ahead and get the last one in. I'm using, not using my tongs to drop the steak. Nice, nice little sear. All right, we're gonna go ahead and let that work. Let's let that work, see what it does there. So now, what do we have? We have our steaks working. We have the steaks working now, right? That's what we have going on. So next, I think I'm gonna do some, I wanna do surf and turf. I think I'm gonna pull out some salmon, get some salmon and uh, throw the salmon on the smoker. I'm not, it's hot out here in Texas, probably about mm, 95, 97 degrees here where I am. But you know, this is what I do for a living. You know, I don't, I don't just use the smoker for holiday purposes. This is my passion. This is my, my calling in life. This is my career. I am a chef and so, Truly, if you can't stand the heat, you gotta get out the kitchen. And this is what I do. I stand the heat, I love what I do. I come to feed the masses and I love to do so. All right, back to work anyway. 